to the brink. What sort of machines are causing the trouble? Nasty ones and lots of them. Bristlebacks, they're called. Strangeness is, they're not native to the Dodge. Just showed up all of a sudden. No hunters to kill them? Well, we've got hunters, just none that want to cross all the boss of chain screen. He is self-appointed. Work stock was his idea. Yeah, well, I'm just passing through. Got an embassy to attend. You should have said that ain't gonna happen no time soon. What are you talking about? Hear that? That's your answer. Who is that? Karja's son priest. Cranked him down yesterday, about an hour before the machine trouble started. He's a very important man, or so he says. That embassy at Baron Light, he's the one supposed to run it. do as I say immediately, the Sun King himself shall hear of your insolence. Thanks to you, I was forced to spend the night shivering in the tent. Exposed to attack, I might have died. Oh, me you refuse to transport, but not this... this... what? This Nora girl? This savage? Besides, Scallywag? Wadis, that's Aloy. Studious Wadis? Aloy, you know, savior of Meridian? Really? Well, that lessens the insult, I suppose. I came here for the Embassy of Baron Light. The way I hear it serves you. Well, not with the valley infested. And so did Aramon proclaim the Sun Priests most precious and worthy of safekeeping. See, Scripture. I shall head to Baron Light when the captain of the Vanguard tells me the way is clear, and not a moment sooner. Fine. Captain's a friend of mine, you know? Where is Erend? Wouldn't mind speaking to someone a little more action, a little less... scroll. Wadis. Studious Wadis. Studious Wadis sent Erend and another Vanguard out at daybreak. To clear the way. And so at daybreak. Hey! Shh. Down the valley then? Yeah. Said they'd check the ruins on the left bank for tracks. Take it from there. Okay. I hear there's a work stoppage. Any way to upgrade my gear? I'll bet the Smith and Chain Scrape would let you use his workbench. As for the bristlebacks, you might want to craft some acid arrows. Hitting their canisters with those will take them down quick. Thanks. Okay. Still I'll got that venom sack from that uh, serpent. Hey. Where do you think you're going? What? To the top of the ridge. To wait in safety. Sorry. Operators under strict orders. No passengers till the whistle blows, right? That's right. <laughs> Best start cranking. <laughs> Why? Why? Jorf, would you kindly escort Studious to chain scrape and wait for me there? You got it. I will find Erend, and I will help clear a path. But after that, no more excuses. Baron Light. Embassy. If such be the will of the sun. It will be. Trust me. I gotta find Erend. But it might be good to hit Chain Scrape first and upgrade my bow. Strong smell.
say, you know, we gotta do this. Do a lot of damage. Machines must have torn through this camp. This valley definitely isn't safe. Cauldrons could teach me how to override these machines, but where would they be?
first map was twice as big as it was in the original game. Greenly blaze, but it's hard and shiny. I wonder if merchants would be interested. Machine. It must be a bristleback. Maybe Errand took it down? Ground soaked with acid. Did the bristlebacks do this? My pack's full, but my stash has room. Chase grape. Jarif said I could get my bow upgraded in there. I'd be able to tinker with my other gear too. Outlander approaching. <laughs> That's a savior. Want to come in, savior? Welcome to Chainscrape, Savior. Open up, guys. Door of service. Good enough for me. By the forge. Petra? Aloy, what are you doing here? About time there was something worth looking at in this dump. It's nice to see you too. And not a moment too soon. Come on. I... Damn brewery's the only thing I can count on in this place. Yeah, I heard. Machines, work stoppage. Oh, those are just the latest malfunctions. Chain scrape's always been a few tools short of a kit. <laughs> and right there is the biggest tool of all. Our land, not our problem. The bristlebacks are everybody's problem. You've heard of him. Yeah. But he's a story best told over a cold beer. Uh, uh, Petra, Petra. I'm just passing through. I'm headed west. Oh. There's an embassy at, at Baron Light I need to make happen, and then I keep moving. Ah, of course. Bigger gears to grind. Well, flame hair, 
Good to see you. Gotta move on. Petra. But, if you want a cold beer and a few laughs with an old friend, come find me at the brewery. Your choice. Hmm. She want that beer. Oh, this old one guy sounds like trouble. Maybe Petra could use some support. But first things first, I need to find that workbench and upgrade my bow. from here oh we can't get there yet Deals acid damage now a little bit. Oh, sorry, you should focus. Scan enemies, see what leads to acid. Hit when enemies with acid will build up the corroding state. Once in the state, an enemy's armor takes damage over time. It has reduced its damage resistance. Shoot acid canisters and acid arrows to detonate them and trigger a large elemental explosion. This should be useful. Now I just need to find Erend and help him clear the bristlebacks. Stayed in their sacred lands. Why are you not letting me go with the video yet? Is this it? Hey, Milda. Milda. I took some of your stew last time I went into the wilds. Kept me going for a week. Felt like I could have put a strider in a sleeper hole. Enjoy it while it lasts. Sounds like you're serving up some uh, impressive provisions here. <sighs> Not again. You can have the discount too, but you'll have to come back later. I think you have me confused with someone else. Oven didn't send you? No. Oh, 
My apologies. It's just that his minions won't stop pestering me. <sighs> now I've even worn out my special grip. Since I'm in the midst of a crisis, perhaps you could skip to what it is you wanted. Some of your food? Oh, of course. Are Alden's people causing you problems? Oh, yeah. They constantly demand my best, but the equipment I need to make my signature dishes isn't built for batch cooking. And don't get me started on the Olden discount they feel so entitled to. And if you refuse? I make meals. No trouble. How did you end up in Chainscape? Heard about a new and upcoming town at the edge of the frontier. Where there's a town, there's a tavern. I was in need of work. So I got myself out here and started cooking. Some of these people had never tasted proper boars and berries stew before. Anyway, next thing I knew, people kept coming back. Guess they liked my food. More than ale. Your last customer mentioned your cooking really kept him going out in the wild. Where I'm headed, I could use some of that. I would be happy to oblige, especially since you have the decency to ask pleasantly. But... But my special brew griddle is no more. Without it, I can't cook any of my signature dishes. I hate to think what'll happen when I'm forced to refuse Olden or his goons. Even if I already had the right ingredients, there's nothing I can do. Unless you can source me a temporary replacement? What do you need? For the ingredients. A few pieces of decent wild meat, and I'd say a big handful of bitter leaf stems. That'll do. As for the griddle, a corrugated metal panel might suffice until I can have a new one forged. You'd likely find one in a scrounger pile if you follow the river to the northeast. Don't worry, I'll clean it first. <laughs> You'll have no issue finding boars and bitter leaf on your way, assuming you're as much a hunter gatherer as your clothing suggests. Thanks, Smildiff. I'll keep an eye out. So that's what gratitude sounds like. And don't let anyone push you around, okay? If you say so. Do you want, Alden? Some kind of payment? My dear magistrate, you think I can be bought? If you want that whistle blown, all you have to do is have your soldiers remove the bristlebacks and sign the concession decree. Face it, what other choice do you have? <clears throat> Hi. Savior, what auspicious timing. Might we discuss a matter of importance to the Sundom? We might. Later. Very well. I shall be waiting. So, the savior herself. Walloper of Durval, gutter of youth. Uh, maybe. I've heard many tales of your beauty and heroics, my fierce lady warrior. Olfant Freehold, at your service. So, what could have dragged you away from the fine silks and wine of Meridian to this smudge of a settlement? Your saviorly attention must be needed elsewhere. I'm here for the embassy and... The embassy? Why, well, uh, by the forge. Ah. Greater gears for greater matters. Guess that means you'll be moving on. Once I've dealt with any problems around here that need my... saviorly attention. Ah, the bristlebacks, of course. Got to get rid of them if you want that embassy to take place. Well, best get to it, hey? And off you go. Not so fast. You don't seem to have a high opinion of the magistrate. Well, I refuse to play nice to some fancy-robed parchment pusher when my fellow laborers are being bullied, intimidated, and taken advantage of. How noble of you. Noble? Ha! Born with a hammer in hand, I was. Nobody handed me anything or dropped opportunity into my lap. 
Everything I've achieved, I've done on my own. And where is this hammer now? The, uh, burden of leadership forced me to set it aside. The Karja risk nothing while demanding that good Osram gamble with their lives out there. Someone had to step up and say no more. You ordered the work stoppage? Indeed I did. We're laborers, not soldiers. Until the Karja clean up their mess and give us the fair deal we deserve, I'm not risking Osram lives. Fair deal? You mean your concession decree? <laughs> it's not my decree. It's on behalf of all the good Osram laborers of this land who do all the backbreaking work, while only the Karja reap the rewards. All we're asking for is the ability to share in this prosperity for a land worked by the people, for the people. Right. And just how much would be your share? Only an amount appropriate to my contributions to this community, uh, of course. Where's the whistle? Right in the middle of town, but with the threat out there, I'm not endangering innocent Osram lives. I'm going to clear out the bristlebacks. And when I'm done, this valley is going to get moving. If that's what it takes. Until then, I'll keep looking after the safety of these good folk. Just be ready to blow the whistle. Better see what that Karja magistrate wanted. I bet he's in the tavern. Savior, thank you for taking the time. And my condolences that you had to endure Olvan's bloviating. I've dealt with worse. It sounds like he's really trying to put you over the barrel. The idea that the Karja purposely let Bristlebacks into the dawn, it's... It's completely absurd. But the louder and longer he says it, the more support he'll get for his damned concession decree. How did the Bristlebacks get into the Daunt? No one knows for sure. The first report of them came from west of the quarry. But unless they have wings, I don't know about. I don't see how they could have come over the mountains. No other way in. The only way I know about is barren light. Look, if you can get to the bottom of this, I can offer a considerable bounty in return. Help me shut Alvin up. How did you get stuck out here? I asked for the posting, believe it or not. Overseeing the entire valley on behalf of the Sun King? It was an honor. Is an honor, I mean. But your job would be a lot easier without someone like Ulvind blasting hot air all the time? Ulvind's not going anywhere. He's been around longer than I have. Even fancies himself the founder of Chainscrape. I'll find a way to live with him. I have to. How did you get stuck out here? I asked for the posting, believe it or not. Overseeing the entire valley on behalf of the Sun King? It was an honor. Is an honor, I mean. But your job would be a lot easier without someone like Ulvind blasting hot air all the time? Ulvind's not going anywhere. He's been around longer than I have. Even fancies himself the founder of Chainscrape. Well, I'll find a way to live with him. I have to. You said the Bristlebacks were first spotted west of the quarry? Yes, according to one terrified laborer, said the ground trembled before they came charging down the hillside. He took off and ran all the way here. Good place to start looking, then. 
If you learn the truth, maybe Olund will stop blaming the Karja for every problem under the sun, and maybe then he'll actually focus on rebuilding Baron Light instead. Thank you guys for joining me. Until next time.